So then we are back with more understandings from the time of the Second Tabernacle Services that we find in the Aramaic English translation of the word. This translation comes from the original manuscripts of the prophets of the Tzayelic lineage. So then we can understand the time of the end, as per Yerushiahu, the prophet, the prophet that was slain, he was sown in half because of his beliefs. He did, obviously, explain the instructions and he mentioned the spring feast, autumn feast and also the returning of the cities of the Messiah laid away for many centuries but then people during his time did not believe him because not even the spring feast was completed at that time they were roughly more than 500 years away from the completion of the spring feast but he was explaining already the time of the restoration of the cities where then not even the holy city of Yohanan was yet completed. So then during this time, we find then the nations understanding more often the returning of the holy cities, and then the world is trying again of having the same leadership as then the last 200 years where then America was then the leading force of the world's power. At this time, it's not so. Obviously, there are some aspects of the military situation regarding the Northern Kingdom or the Soviet Union and also America, the desire for then the reduction of the nuclear weapons and uh, it's not working. It was already explained from the Soviet side. There are other problems they must resolve first prior of this topic and the understanding is they won't ever resolve those problems because what we must expect is Daniel the 11th chapter where then obviously the later the status of the Soviet Union become higher than the first must have the military unification of China and Soviet Union so then Daniel 11 can be completed so then during this time where then the presidents came together they tried themselves come up with some sort of idea and then trying to push away China it's not going to work obviously the Pacific region and the Asian market is going to start pick up the motion as they were some five months ago and even further because this system of these leaders coming together last it won't last for very long so then not only because a person is not being negative but a person must be positive as far as, as the delineation of what Daniel has said then layered with Yerushiahu the prophet understandably the objective is reaching then Ezekiel the 37th chapter and then the restoration of the sticks of authority where then the Ishmaelites they receive then the directive via then petroleum because we understand the freighters of the earth at some point they're going to become more prominent more vocal and the danger at the moment is obviously understanding the fact of not having USDV or then the virtual monetary unit so then the trade of the end can be then established via computer it is absolutely so basic it is so easy understanding nations are not being prepared with their virtual monetary system the dragon is very smart he has used then the existing positive side of the monetary system via paper money regulated by bank and also by government and then the virtual system where you do not have the regulation of banking neither the government as far as a benefit of the midman it is then removed from the understanding where then people can receive more income by having direct trade with China 
precisely this system then is coming and as far as nations not having then the virtual system they are going to force themselves of adopting then the Chinese system as a means of purchase as a means of trade does not mean that a country is going to be using the one as their exchange does not mean this it means then they have to buy the yuan units the virtual yuan units so then they can do direct trade with China because there are a couple of systems playing at the same time the regular paper money the virtual money both of them are intertwined we don't understand the virtual yet and most further because we can't back it up we don't have enough production so then this time where these leaders they came together it would be similar as during the time when then America was birthing itself on the 4th of July more than a couple hundred years ago and then the British they tried to come together and then obviously imposing their empire so this time is the very transitional time where the nations they are trying to come together and then re-establishing themselves as per then the last 200 years of the thousand years given of the seat it's not going to work a hundred percent not we must understand then the 11th chapter of Daniel as is specific for the time of the restoration period you find a structure in Daniel if you understand times and seasons Shaliak Shaul said as far as his times and seasons he would not have to explain it obviously he was speaking during a time of transition from the first tabernacle service to the second tabernacle services he was explaining the initiation of the holy cities obviously they were acquainted with it but after more than a thousand years those cities laid a waste people they don't understand what it means but because they don't understand what it means does not mean what they want then must be implemented because it won't be that's why then Shaliak Shaul was very strong he said as far as his times and the seasons they would not have to be explained he starts with the very core of the understanding of the prophecies times and seasons do we understand times and seasons no these leaders they came together and they tried to come up with ideology of their own it's not going to work it's already showing signs of the breakage of what they thought would work the northern kingdom already is not lining up with the desire of the others of reducing nuclear weapons so then you find then people and the nations trying to corner China it's not going to work have this in mind the system or the new system of the trade of the end is already uploaded the system is already backed up it's backed up by banking it's backed up by gold it's backed up by production there is no way of going around it we have a very short 30 months it used to be 36 months we have 30 months the very most so then nations can come up with their virtual monetary system as units based from the average price of the gold standard of China and what they understand as the average of their own as far as the pricing of the yuan as a constant serving as the basis for the units of a virtual because these are related with production they are related then with the gold price and this is what's going to drive the market in the future obviously then if you are familiar with Bitcoin it's a combination of Bitcoin system with a standard way of banking if you use a Bitcoin system you can buy products and you won't pay taxes 
the person on the other side receiving your bitcoins, if a person is then loyal and then trustworthy, would then pay taxes. But they don't have to pay taxes. Because the government has no way of tracking it. It's a monetary system outside of the central bank and banking regulation. So then when you purchase units in a virtual system, governments have no way of tracking it. And when you make your order via the same system, they have no clue how to tax it. And they have no clue what's coming in the parcel. But then thousands upon thousands of people investing in the system, investing in products, and then receiving via the same system the parcels. You can have an idea what's going to be of the ports and airports. Obviously no space. And then worst yet, not able to search through those cargoes. Because where there is no link with taxation and freighting, there is no way of finding out what's in the boxes. They have to have security stations so they can scan through each of those parcels and find out what's in them. But then you multiply by 10 ships waiting at the harbor at the same time for unloading and no space, no security, and no taxation. When this time comes, the president is going to be absolutely the first to get over there in the midst of the freighters and ask you what they want. Thus far, our government is playing stupid. They think they have the forward motion of it. They think they can come up with their own schemes. They think they can get a hold of the situation as it is. They are mistaken. The system of the East is already uploaded. There is a central computer already with the entire system uploaded. It's only a situation of a time. And there are people with no jobs eager for the system so then they can invest their money and receive. So then, what we can expect from the very near future is China being further cornered, as it was explained before. The nations will try to come together in their own schemes and they will try to corner China until China is forced to make a deal with the Northern Kingdom. Then they unify their militaries. Then the system is then downloaded. Then those nations without a virtual monetary system, they have to buy the yuan units based from their price of the yuan. Could be, at that time, could be the average price of gold or could be something else. They could charge the yuan twice as much. But because it is a unit related directly with production, and nations of the third world countries are buying these because they are refurbishing themselves. You can imagine how easy it is for China to change the value of their yuan. Nations, they have no choice but buying the yuan at the price posted. Because we are no longer dealing with the regulations of scoundrels, of bankers. We are dealing with direct production. And when direct production is on demand, they can change the yuan price any time they want. So then, let's make sure we understand these nations that came together, for instance, U.S., then Germany, and then France, and then other countries came together over there in their visit and their reunion. It's not going to work. The person that has the forward motion of this is China. China is backed up by the Soviet Union. And it was explained before. These people would come together, try to come up with their own schemes. They would corner China. China is going to be forced of making a deal with Northern Kingdom.
That's Wade.